I think Ranjit Singh really recognized his role as a Maharaja. And as a Maharaja, he realized that the, the public court had to be a place almost of theater and drama. So the throne represents part of that. It's in fact the centerpiece of what would have been a very lavish court scene for public, uh, for public viewing. The throne is absolutely loaded with symbolism. It's the, the most predominant motif is that of, that of the lotus flower. It's there in the inlay work, but it's also there in the actual, the actual structure of the throne itself. And the lotus flower has, uh, has great resonance with Sikhs because in Sikh scripture, the lotus is used as a metaphor for man's journey throughout life. The lotus lives in dirty bracken water, but of course, this pure white flower emerges from it. And so the Sikh gurus use that metaphor time and time again to talk about how humanity should live in the, uh, in the real world. So in its form, what the Maharaja is doing is he's placing himself very much at the centre of a, of a blossoming lotus flower. So there he is in court, in the centre of this sort of opulent scene. And he's not only is he the Maharaja sitting in an elevated position, but he's almost a godhead as well, sitting inside this blooming lotus.